For some of us, even buying an ordinary home can be difficult, but there are some homes which are only fit for the richest amongst us. That's because only they can afford them. Imagine your perfect dream house and then increase it tenfold in size. Add the most luxurious amenities and facilities, and the most gorgeous infrastructure. And there you have it, that home will be able to make its way to this list and well, as much as we all love our own humble abouts, it is always fun to look at some of the most expensive, luxurious and beautiful properties around the world. Today Absolute Luxury brings you the list of the 10 most amazing homes in the world. Are you excited for this amazing ride? Subscribe to Absolute Luxury and ring the bell icon to get updates on the latest uploads. Let's get started. Number 10. Kensington Palace Gardens, London, $128 million. Kensington Palace Gardens was designed by Philip Hardwick for Sutherland Hall Sutherland, and the first tenant was the civil engineer James Meadows Rendell, who probably became resident in early 1852, and died there in 1856. The property is now owned by Indian business magnate and billionaire, Lakshmi Mittal. He is the chairman and CEO of the world's largest steel-making company, Arcelor Mittal. The house is roughly 55,000 square foot and it was originally two semi-detached houses, later being converted into a single dwelling by, developer, David Carlili. It has 12 bedrooms, an indoor pool, Turkish baths, and enough parking spaces for 20 cars. Before Mr. Mittal purchased the property, it was owned by some pretty famous and wealthy families. The Rothschilds, Free Poles, David Carlili, and Bernie Eccleston. Now Mount Mittal can enjoy the peace of mind knowing that his neighbors are Prince William and Kate Middleton. Number 9. Palazzo di Amore, Beverly Hills, California, $195 million. It's no surprise that one of the most expensive homes in the world, can be found in Beverly Hills, California. Palazzo di Amore is owned by successful real estate entrepreneur, Jeff Green, and is approximately 53,000 square feet. The Mediterranean-style villa has 12 bedrooms, 23 bathrooms, numerous swimming pools, tennis courts, waterfalls and theaters, and also has a 27-car garage. Now, if you're into partying then you'll be interested to know that the house also has a revolving dance floor and ballroom, ready to bust the moves whenever you want. The house generally looks more like a holiday resort than someone's home, but we can assure you that it is one of the world's most expensive homes. Number 8. Ellison Estate, Woodside, California, $200 million. This 23-acre property belongs to Oracle co-founder Larry Ellison. Within the compound, you will find 10 different properties, a tea house and bathhouse, a man-made lake and a koi pond. Much of the design of the estate falls under Japanese influence, and was modeled after a Japanese emperor's palace. The house was designed by Paul Driscoll, who was an architect and Zen Buddhist teacher. Throughout the estate grounds, you will also find some very expensive trees, like cherry blossoms, maples, oaks and redwoods. Number 7. 4 Fairfield Pond, Sagaponic, New York. $248 million. You can't have a list of the most expensive houses in the world, and not have one located in New York City. 4 Fairfield Pond is the home of Ira Renner, owner of the Renner Group a holding investment company in smelting and manufacturing. The 63-acre home comes equipped with 29 bedrooms, 39 bathrooms, a 91-foot dining room, basketball court, bowling alley, squash courts, tennis courts, and three swimming pools. To power the mansion, it requires a gigantic amount of electricity, fortunately, the house comes with its very own power plant located on site. And, for those of you that love your cars, 4 Fairfield Pond has a garage, that can hold somewhere in the region of 100 cars. Number 6. 
The Odeon Tower Penthouse, Monte Carlo, Monaco, $330 million. With an estimated value of $330 million, the Odeon Tower Penthouse is right up there with the most expensive houses in the world. For that kind of money, you'll get a 35,000 square foot apartment at the very top of one of the most expensive buildings in Monaco. The Tour Odeon was designed by architect Alexandre Giraldi, and developed by group Mesa Coco. The penthouse is spread out over several floors and includes its own private elevator. If that's not enough, then how about a private water slide into a 360 degree view infinity pool? Number 5. Le Palais Boule, France. $390 million. Coined the Bubble Palace, Le Palais Boule was designed by Hungarian architect, Antti Lovag, and was built somewhere in the region of 1975 to 1989. Its nickname comes from a series of round rooms that look out over the Mediterranean Sea. Lovig's inspiration for the design of the property came from man's earliest dwellings, however, this dwelling has been seriously upgraded with some really nice creature comforts. For example, the property has three swimming pools, numerous gardens and a 500-seat amphitheater built into the hillside grounds. Bubble Palace is currently owned by Pierre Cardin, an Italian-born French fashion designer. Number 4. Villa Le Cedre, French Riviera, France, $450 million. Estimated at $450 million, this home getting close to being worth almost half a billion dollars. It was first built in 1830, and purchased by King Leopold II of Belgium in 1904. The property is set on approximately 35 acres of gardens, and its name derives from the many cedar trees located throughout its grounds. The house itself is roughly 18,000 square feet and consists of 14 bedrooms. It also has an Olympic-sized swimming pool and a large stable, big enough for 30 horses. Inside, you'll find crystal chandeliers, gilded woodwork, 19th-century oil paintings, and a wood-paneled library holding somewhere in the region of 3,000 books. Number 3. Villa Leopolda, Côte d'Azur, France. $750 million. The house name comes from its original owner, King Leopold II of Belgium, and was redesigned in the 1920s by American architect, Ogden Codman Jr. The villa, is owned by the Lily Safra. It's located in the Francis Alps Maritime Department of its Côte d'Azur region, and occupies approximately 50 acres. It has 11 bedrooms, 14 bathrooms, a commercial greenhouse, helipad, outdoor kitchen and one of the nicest swimming pools you'll ever see. The property is famous in itself, as it was the setting for Alfred Hitchcock's 1955 film, To Catch a Thief. Number 2. Antilia, Mumbai, India. $1 billion. It was designed and constructed by Chicago-based architecture firm, Perkins & Will and hospitality design firm, Hirsch Bender Associates. The property was built for Mukesh Ambani, the chairman and managing director of Reliance Industries Limited, a Fortune Global 500 company, and India's richest man. The 400,000 square foot building is positioned in Mumbai's Kambala Hill, neighbored and stands at an impressive 27 stories high. It's also been built to withstand an earthquake of magnitude 8 on the Richter scale. Inside the house, you find six floors that are purely devoted to car storage, a service station for the cars, a temple, a 50-seat movie theater and nine elevators. It also has a health spa, three helipads, a salon, a ballroom and yoga studio, an ice cream room and multiple cinemas. So, when all that's said and done, Antilla reportedly requires a staff of at least 600 to keep things running smoothly. Number 1. Buckingham Palace, London, UK. $2.9 billion. The palace is owned by the British royal family, and is one of a number of lavish properties in their portfolio. It is located in the city of Westminster, London, and comprises of 775 rooms, 78 bathrooms, 92 offices and 19 staterooms. 
It's been the official residence of the monarchy since 1873. In terms of size, the palace checks in at approximately 828,000 square feet, and the garden alone is 40 acres. However, despite its impressive size and taking the title of the most expensive house in the world, it's still not the largest palace in the world. It's estimated that if the palace were to be put up for sale, it would be somewhere in the region of $2.9 billion, but it's highly unlikely it will ever happen. Well that was today's video guys, thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed our list of the 10 most expensive houses in the world. Let us know which one is your favorite house, in the comment section, also do subscribe to our channel. Stay tuned as we bring more interesting content to your screens.